Hey Chelsea fans, what's up? I hope you're doing well. Um, uh, yet another day, yet another video, yet more news as far as Chelsea is concerned. This one largely about Trevor Shaloba and his future at Chelsea Football Club. A couple of developments have just come through today and we're going to be getting into those. My name is Desire Derek von Mugumisa. Thank you so much for joining me yet again on this particular uh, uh, video and this channel and all of that. So much content for you to take in and I tell you, subscribe to the channel today, like this video and please turn on the notification bell so you don't get to miss out on any of the other content we bring your way. Follow me on social media. I am at Dmugumisa on X and Dmugumisa on Instagram and at Double Dmugumisa on TikTok. Now, this morning, big, big headlines got to come our way from Fabrizio Romano and this is exactly it. Let's get into it. Inter are now confident to get Benjamin Pavard deal done. Direct contact with Bayern ongoing right now. Talks advancing well to make the deal happen today on 30 million euros fee plus 2 million euros add-ons. I wonder how everything just changed just like that. Well, we know why and that is exactly because of this next tweet that we're going to be looking at. A tweet that came in a little earlier than the one I just shared with you and here we go. This one, uh, of course, courtesy of Niza Kinsella. Bayern Munich remain keen on signing Trevor Shaloba despite having an initial loan bid rejected. Chelsea are only interested in a permanent sale and have set a 50 million pound asking price for Chaloba, which has so far deterred suitors. All right, now that is the big development for the longest part of this summer. We've had Benjamin Pavard trying to leave Bayern Munich. At first it was so he could go to Manchester United. Those links died out, if, uh, if we can put it that way. And uh, we need to remember, of course, for some of us, when we talk about Pavard, you're thinking about the right back from uh, the World Cup and all of those. Nowadays, he is a centre back, a right centre back, who can also play as right back. So, um, when those links died out, uh, then the links of Pavard going to Inter Milan developed. And uh, for long, he's been pushing for that, missing games and all of those kinds of things. Just recently, Thomas Tuchel came out to say that, well, we understand that uh, this young man, Pavadi, is trying to move to Inter Milan, but until we find a replacement, nothing is going to be done. Now, the tweet I just read to you from Kinsella is one that came out yesterday. The one that from Fabrizio that opened the show came out this particular morning. Now, with the interest coming in from Bayern Munich for Trevor Shaloba coming yesterday and then now the deal for Pavard starting to move uh, towards Inter Milan, it is all the indication you need to know that there must be some agreements that are getting to happen. Maybe the 50 million pounds that has been deterring suitors might not be a figure that Chelsea are still sticking to, especially when you see that uh, Bayern Munich are looking to make about 30 plus 2 million euros, not even pounds, euros to sell that is uh, Pavard to Inter Milan. Maybe they're getting closer to a similar figure so yeah, we received that much from Inter Milan and we give it to Chelsea to bring in Shaloba as a replacement. That is something that we shall continue to study. About the same time that that first tweet came out, um, the one of Romano and Fabrizio, well, Simon Phillips um, uh, was sharing a tweet that he had seen from uh, at CF Bayern and that was talked with uh, uh, Trevor Chaloba. Chelsea and FC Bayern are getting hot. Now, that could be anything, but if you see what uh, Fabrizio Romano is reporting, then they're getting hot in terms of something is coming together over there. And then, of course, uh, yeah, Chelsea, that is according, of course, uh, to Nizar Kinsella. Chelsea will listen to Trevor Shaloba and, and, and that is the key part, Mark Kukurea bids before transfer deadline. So, yeah. It doesn't mean that it will be Manchester United uh, necessarily for Marco Correa. But if anyone else comes through with a suitable deal, it looks like Marco Correa will be on his way out of Chelsea Football Club. And that will mean Ian Madsen might be the backup for, to Ben Chilwell as far as the left wing back, left back and all of that kind of situation position gets to go. Ladies and gentlemen, on that note, we come to the end of this particular video. That was the update on that. For more of these updates, subscribe to this channel, um, uh, like this video, turn on the notification bell, and follow me on social media at Dimogunisa on X, at Dimogunisa on Instagram, and at Dawa Dimogunisa on TikTok. So much more Chelsea gets to happen right here because, hey, together we keep the blue flag flying high.